hi there welcome to my soft skill session on decision making and decision making is very important because right from morning till night we end up taking so many decisions every day i need to choose what do i want for my breakfast and before sleeping i want to choose what do i want for my dinner in between this you take so many decisions hence it is important when the impact is not huge any decision would be fine however if the impact is huge we would like to take an active involvement in decision making because we will be held responsible for the decision taken now there are three types of decisions that we all should know when we are not capable of taking a decision probably we lack the subject knowledge we leave it to others to take a decision on our behalf so we call it as no decision it's as good as leaving the decision taking capacity to somebody else snap decision when you have limited time and you have very limited options you have to pick up something to ensure there is lot of urgency in implementing the decision so such times you have to rely on taking a snap decision a quick decision responsible decision this is a decision which requires a proper thought process and analysis when you take a decision you need to consider two things into your purview the decision that you are going to take is it going to affect only me or is there somebody else whom it is going to affect second important thing is it going to be a solution only for now or is it going to be a solution for the long run as well so these two things are very important let us try to understand them with the case of an example tomorrow is the last day to pay the examination fees and your father has not sent you the money what will you do i hope you got the question very clear now the problem statement you have no money and you need to pay the examination fees what is the cause of the problem you are expecting some money to come to your account by your father unfortunately he has not sent the money for some reason maybe he did not get his salary on time probable solution that you can think about so these are this is a problem statement this is a cause for the problem what are the alternatives request the university authorities to give additional time or postpone the last date this cannot happen because it's not only you who will be affected by postponing the last date or the examination time table but the others also a larger audience group will be affected so it's not a possible alternative what is the second alternative sell my mobile and pay the fees not only now but tomorrow you might require your mobile phone today you are selling your mobile but tomorrow what if you need it for some purpose so you cannot take this decision because it is not a viable solution wait for somebody to help without doing anything it is as good as taking no decision so i would not advise you to do that because this is a time where you need to act fast act fast borrow money from your friends and repay it once you get from your dad this is a possible solution because it is affecting just one friend of yours and probably you are taking a consent from him is it okay if i pay you once i receive the sal uh, you know money from my father so this actually ensures that it is not affecting too many people and it is not just a decision which is going to help you right now but once you get the money you are going to pay it back to him and in the long run also it seems to be a viable solution think for other alternatives if you have any so this is an example and this is how you actually take a decision if you look at the previous case we did define the problem and the cause for the problem and once we define the problem and we dis also discuss the cause for the problem it helped us to find multiple alternative solutions what is the best possible solution which is satisfying the two conditions not only i am getting affected and also not only now and it is also helping me to have a stable future so now you start prioritizing prioritizing them and taking into consideration what is the best possible option 
and basis on these two factors you are selecting one of them from the solution so taking a viable and acceptable decision will involve all the above steps and once you take this decision it will have it will have to be implemented to solve the problem and in case you feel that this particular solution is not working then keep brainstorming and look for more solutions always remember once you have made your decision you cannot look back so when you are taking a decision you have to be very careful so here is a small case study for you you are organizing your college sports day just one hour before the function you are informed that three prizes are missing what decisions do you make remember it's not hard to make decisions when you know what are your values so this is something which was said by roy disney and i hope you definitely like my session and if you like it you can always uh, share it and subscribe to my channel thank you so much you have a nice day